research is now saying that kids ages eight to 18 are spending on average seven and a half hours a day on screens. And that number goes up even higher for teenagers, like nine to 10 hours a day on screens. Kids who are constantly in front of screens typically have sleep problems, behavior issues, poor social skills, they have a harder time focusing and concentrating, and they are less active outside. You know, our whole event here is about answering questions that parents have. And when it comes to screen use in kids, I think parents, most parents, not all parents, I don't think we're asking the question of, is screen time bad for kids? We already know that it is. The evidence is out there, the science is out there. I don't think we're asking that question because we already know the answer. I think the question that we parents are asking is how much screen time can we get away with before it causes any damage? And I know that's what parents are asking because I'm asking it too. I'll be honest with you guys. And so I, I know the convenience of screens. Like it is so much more convenient to hand your child, whether a big kid or a toddler, to hand them a screen when they're losing their minds at a restaurant, so much easier than staying the course and trying to turn the ship around like it's so much easier to do that it's so much easier to hand off a device or to turn on the tv whenever you're having a bad day or you just need a minute to relax like it's so much more convenient but i think that instead of asking how much screen time can we get away with i think that there is a better question that we can be asking let's flip the script instead of asking how much screen time can we get away with? What if we started asking, what other things could my child be doing instead of being on a screen? Or how would their, how would my kids' lives be different if they weren't so attached to screens or if they didn't use them at all? I think that when we significantly reduce the screens, it makes way for more fun and a happier childhood. If I was a doctor and I wanted to write a prescription to help families be more united and have stronger family bonds, I would write a prescription for fun. Kids need more fun, parents need more fun, we need to be having fun together. One of the best things that you can ever do for your children is to simply have fun together. We were created with all of the emotions by God's design. And as Christians, we have the ultimate source of hope, of joy, and of fun. That's the Holy Spirit. It says in John chapter 10, verse 10, the thief comes only to steal and kill and destroy. I have come that they may have life and have it to the full. Life to the full. That means enjoying life. That means enjoying your families. Kids need to see us having fun. They need to know that we want to have fun with them, that we want to enjoy our lives together as a family. And you might be thinking, but JJ, my kids have so much fun playing video games and playing on their iPads and watching videos. Yeah. But all fun is not created equal. There's a big difference between having connected quality time fun face to face with someone. There's a big difference between that and doing something alone and isolated where you are not even really participating, you're just watching. Those are big differences. It is more beneficial for your family unit to be together playing a board game than it is for everyone to be in the same house, but doing their own things in different rooms. Connected family time where there is a lightheartedness and joy, that is the difference maker. You know, and it's, it's not about doing extravagant things. Fun does not have to be extravagant. It's all about the simple things. Going on a walk together, going outside, going, exploring through the woods or a nature trail, doing crafts together, playing a board game together. Whatever is fun for you can be fun for your kids too. It's all about inviting them into your life and letting them know that they have a place with you. It's all about doing these simple things together that can be fun.